This is a demonstration of how to perform a rapid response COVID-19 antigen rapid test. The test kit contains a test device, a sterile swab, a tube stand, an extraction tube, a nozzle with filter, and an extraction buffer. A clock, timer or stopwatch is required for the test but is not provided in the kit. Bring all testing materials and specimens to room temperature before use. Open the pouch and lay the test cassette on a clean, level surface. Label the device in a clean extraction tube with patient identification. After labeling the tube, place it back onto the tube stand. Gently mix the extraction buffer. Add 10 drops of buffer to the tube. Avoid touching the tip of the buffer bottle to the tube. Have the patient blow their nose with a tissue before specimen collection. Remove the swab from the packaging. Avoid touching the tip to any surfaces, including sterile gloves. Tilt the patient's head 70 degrees. Insert the swab at least half an inch inside the nostril. Swab the nasal orifice for at least 5 seconds using a circular motion. Press the patient's nostril against the swab. While the swab is compressed, rotate the tip for at least 5 seconds. Repeat the procedure with the other nostril using the same swab. Swab the nasal orifice for at least 5 seconds using a circular motion. Press the patient's nostril against the swab. While the swab is compressed, rotate the tip for at least 5 seconds. Process the swab as soon as possible after collecting the sample. Insert the swab into the extraction tube. Tilt the tube so that the entire swab head is submerged in the solution. Mix well and squeeze the swab 10 to 15 times by compressing the walls of the tube against the swab. Place the tube with the swab back onto the tube stand. Set a timer. Let the solution stand for 2 minutes. Pinch the swab in the tube to squeeze as much liquid as possible out of the swab. Remove the swab and dispose of it according to your appropriate biohazard waste disposal protocol. Securely place the nozzle onto the tube. Carefully invert the tube and add three drops of the solution into the sample well. Set a timer. Read the results at 15 minutes. A positive result shows two lines. A line in the control region, C, and any visible line in the test region, T. A faint line in the test region is also considered to be positive. A negative result shows one line. A line in the control region and no apparent line in the test region. An invalid result shows no line in the control region. The results from a test that has not produced a control band at the specified read time must be discarded. Please review the instructions and repeat the procedure with a new test. If the problem persists, Discontinue using the kit immediately and contact your local distributor. Thank you for choosing Rapid Response.